This video was recorded by a remotely operated vehicle owned by the Shell Oil Company a few hundred miles from Houston, Texas. It shows what is usually called the Big Fin Squid, but the thing is, it looks like it's acknowledging that it's being recorded. The video was first released to the public in early 2008. Some people thought that this video shows proof of alien life on Earth. Big fins that have been caught were juveniles, so it isn't known how big they can be. One fact about them is that they are found up to 20,000 feet deep into the ocean. This squid almost looks like the alien from the movie Nope. It looks like a genuine video. What are your opinions on the clip? Let me know in the comment section. I think it's alive. This video takes place in Goderidge, Ontario, near a nuclear power plant. Two friends began to record as they came upon a huge mass in the water. The shape looked to have perfect edges to it and had air bubbles float to the surface of the water from it. The two were afraid to move any closer to the object in the water with good reason. Whatever it is, could it be there due to the nuclear power plant? What do you think? Well, I'm not going in in case it's like some giant sea moss monster or something. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah. I'm afraid of it. Why don't you go and put your hand in there and see if it bites? This video is of a little girl on an inflatable unicorn who was swept away by the sea currents. The girl who was between the ages of four and five was with her parents. Her parents were playing with her and turned away for a split second to speak with some friends. And all of a sudden, their daughter was swept away. When the parents realized that their daughter was gone, they informed the port authorities, in which they alerted the captain of the local ferry that was nearby. As you can see, the little girl was calm. Around the same time, that same fairy rescued an elderly man who was swept out to sea. If this little girl was younger, the outcome would have been way different. You guys okay? Are you in trouble? In this video, a group of fishermen spot two girls who look to be struggling in the water. But the fishermen weren't sure at first. The fishermen called out to the girls asking if they needed help. To their surprise, the girls said yes. The fishermen found out that the girls were caught in the current and swept out to sea. So a few tips. Stay away from the dark, narrow gaps in the water that are in between whitewash. That is a rip current going out to sea. Has this ever happened to you?
You guys okay? Or are you in trouble? Okay. Stand by. Stand by. We're getting you. Take this. Take the camera. You're fine. We're gonna get you. We're gonna get you. Don't worry. Just keep coming. We got a ladder and everything. You're fine. You're fine. Be calm. Be calm. Be calm. There's a ladder right there. Come on in. Come on in. Calm down. I left. Oh. Come on in. Easy. Uh, go in there, it's warm. Go inside, it's warm. Go inside, it's warm. Go inside, it's warm. Oh, we got you. Thank God we saw you. Oh, my God. In this video, a man on a kayak is between a tiger shark and a turtle. Then eventually, the shark flips his kayak. He may sound like he's joking, but if the shark were to get a hold of him, it would be game over. Why do you think this man is so happy and in such a good mood about what's going on? What are your thoughts? Oh, this is intense. They're, they're underneath me. Look, the tiger's got the turtle underneath me. Oh, I don't know if I'm in the best position right here. Oh, I'm between the tiger and the turtle. Uh-oh. Oh, oh what? This video shows a spear fisherman in the middle of the ocean when all of a sudden a bull shark charges him. Luckily the fisherman was paying attention because, from the looks of it, the shark was focused on one thing and one thing only. That fisherman would not have made it if he didn't respond so quick. If he didn't respond so quick, what do you think would have happened? In this video, a man on a kayak is strolling through the swamp. At one point, you can hear water splashing off camera if, if something was getting in the water. The man on the kayak turns to see what it was, but there was nothing there. He continues to do what he was doing. Then all of a sudden, something happens. With his head going underwater, he was vulnerable to whatever flipped his kayak. 